Hey guys, the Glock 44 22 long rifle. Let's talk about it. Hey everyone, Johnny with South Texas Firearms Training. How's it going guys? Thanks for checking in guys. Uh, today we're talking about the Glock 44, Model 44, uh, chambered in 22 long rifle. Long overdue. I have a few specs for the uh, Glock 44 guys, if you just bear with me. It's a Glock 44 compact, just like the Glock 19. If you are familiar with the Glock 19, 9 millimeter, uh, the Glock 44 has the same, uh, uh, almost the same specs as the uh, Glock 19. It's 22 long rifle. Uh, the barrel is a 4.2 inches and it's a marksman barrel. Also, uh, the weight of these uh, of the Glock 44 is much lighter than the regular pistol, which is 14.62 ounces, empty. All right, and it also comes with two 10-round uh, magazines, which I'm about to change with uh, my buddy of their uh, 2A3D. Uh, if you want to check him out on Instagram, 2A3D, my buddy up there, he's, he does excellent work with, uh, with accessories and, and a bunch of things. That, uh, you might want to go check him out there. I'll, I'll leave a link down below, okay? But um, we're going to be checking the, the Glock 44. 22 long rifle. Let me just check. Uh, let me just show you. Here, this is the Glock 44 chambered in 22, right here. And I have this is the, the Gen 5, of course. The Gen 5, of course, you're gonna have the uh, the little swell up here in the bottom. Uh, ambidextrous uh, slight catch, a slight stop. Okay, and uh, it also has. Uh, uh, adjustable rear sight and it's going to be the the old gold post sights up here the rear sight of course and they're plastic of course but uh, it does have adjustable rear sights up here that you can uh, go ahead and, and uh, work on if you need to change the the, uh, the windage left and right on it okay the uh, i also have the gen 5 uh, 19. now if you see this these two pistols if you don't know which is which, or if you can't see what's going on here, then you would know which is the 22, which is the, the 9 millimeter. Okay, they're very similar in sizes. They're almost the same, the 19 and the 44. Uh, the width is very, very ridiculously very, very similar as well. Uh, also, the backs, backs are the same same size and everything um, what I like about this is you can also use the same holster that you use for your 19 you can use the same holster for the uh, for the 44 um, what's neat about this 44 or the 22 uh, long rifle it comes with two magazines and guess what they they look just like the regular nine millimeters as well of course this is the 19 uh, or i'm sorry the 44 this is the 17 here but the uh the similar the similarities the width and all that as a regular glock mag is is so uh, remarkable uh, you can even use the same uh, uh, mag pouch for your for your 22 as you do with your nine and it, it, it works today we're going to be shooting it so uh, let's see how accurate it is, and let's see how uh, the function. The, we'll be testing the functionality on it soon.
So as you can see guys, the Glock 44 22 long rifle is a pretty good old pistol. On the rapid fire that I did, I used some old Winchester uh, Super X, I believe. Um, I should have stuck with the CCIs. I do the CCI uh, 22 long rifles. Uh, that's what I use on all my semi-automatic pistols and rifles, like the Ruger 1022s. Uh, they cycle better and they have a better uh, uh, reliability. But um, it, it did well. It did well. I had to move that rear sight just a little bit. I was uh, missing a little bit, so I had just to readjust it a little bit, and, and uh, I got back on uh, back on target. But the uh, the Glock 44, man, it, it's a good little pistol. Um, if you're looking for something to train, uh, something that's that's close to uh, a nine millimeter that you carry, or the 40 that you carry, the Glock 40, the, the Glock 23, the Glock 19. Um, the Glock 44 22 long rifle. That's the way to go guys. So remember uh, Next time we'll see you and uh, hopefully we can get uh, some other kind of reviews but uh, till then train how you'll fight